Hello, Math Maniacs. Wow, what a great response we've had for Bond, Math Bonds. So today, I thought I would do a version for multiplication. Let's get going. Bond, multiplication, bond. So just with uh, addition math bonds, uh, you just need to have a whiteboard, cards, and a marker. Before you play this game, of course you want to spend some time exploring equal groups, and this will help your children make that connection with division as well, right? So if I have a 24 and I have a six and a four here, not only does it help me with my multiplication, six times four is 24, but I know that 24 divided by four is gonna give me six and 24 divided by six is going to give me four. Okay, we're gonna just need to, every time you pick a card, you're just making a decision whether you're going to use one card or two. So that's gonna depend on what you have. Okay, so I have a nine. Nine's a pretty good number. And I know there's uh, just maybe two ways of getting nine. So uh, I'm gonna put it up here. I think that's a pretty good idea. Okay, and now I'm going to go again. And oh, this time I have an eight. Now I can't put an eight here because I know nothing eight groups of something is never going to give me nine. So I might just put eight over here. So I'm going to do that. Here we go. Now the next number I pick, I'm looking at it. Mm, uh, I don't really want to put another nine there, so I'm going to decide to make it a product. So now I'm going to get a different card, another card that I can multiply to nine. Oh, and I've got a six. Nine times six or nine groups, equal groups of six gives me 54. So that's a pretty good number. So I'm going to put it up. Oh, no, not up here because eight times that's not going to give me anything. So I'm going to put 54 right there beautiful now my turn to go again I make a decision Ooh, a three I know that if I have three groups of three I'm gonna get nine so I'm gonna chance it and maybe put the three over here okay and let's go to the another one Ooh, eight. Oh boy hmm so I have a 54 there I have an eight here you know what? I'm going to chance it and put the 8 over here. And I'm hoping that I get a 1 over here. That's what I'm hoping for. Who knows what's going to happen? Ooh, a 4. Well, that doesn't help me. So I lose my turn. Okay? And then I'm going to go again. Ooh. I know that if I have nine here and a six here or a six here, I think I'm going to use a six over here. So I just need a nine. Beautiful. Okay, hopefully this makes it. And it's an eight. Oh, darn it. I lose my turn again. And ah, I got a three. Three equal groups of three gives me nine. So I have a bond, a math bond. So that's one way I've modified a uh, math bond for multiplication, but I am sure that there are many different ways that you can modify it to make it more challenging uh, for the students that you have in front of you. So give it a try. Let us know how you did, and we would love to hear your feedback. Thanks. Have fun with this one, guys. Uh -huh.